All right, going into a brand new tournament, we are fighting for intensive training range. So we've been wanting this for a while. Hopefully we can claim it this time. It is Goers vs. Beast, Sykes vs. Glories. We also have, I think, four people that want this training or need this training, so we have a few. Uh, so the reason I want this one specifically is because I want to get uh, Mifari up to uh, 140 range and see if her teamwork with the front line will allow her to pass to them. Uh, because we have this theory that if we train teamwork with her and frontline players, she would pass all the way to the front. That hasn't been the case, but her range is also only at 70, so we're thinking that could be the problem. We'll see though, we'll see though. And it's nice to get this done now, uh, rather than, you know, it being the last training we get her, because then it would just be like end of series. I mean, it's already pretty close to end of series, but still. Looks like Gory's 1-0 to Sykes. Looks like Goers and Sykes are out of here. I mean, that is a, that is a pretty usual usual occurrence. That's not that's not a normal at all. And we get to take on the Killika Beasts. So we are going to overhead max pressure. See what we can do to claim victory. Immediately, Nizrut can't stop us. 1-0. It's all about trends. Do we get that 2-0? Do we just dominate? Do we just play in the midfield? We injured Vorja. That's pretty big. We we took we injured Vorja, then took the ball from his corpse, uh, and then got a second goal. I guess that's I guess that's great for us. And the, yeah, it's it's yeah. So the 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 kill beasts are on the center attack, and we just injured their center. Like what? What are they supposed to do? Like that is just. Uh, that is just unlucky. And there it is, 5-0. That's Fangs versus Glories. Fangs 1-0. Can Glories come back? So far, absolutely not. I'm actually surprised because I think the Glories are the favorites here, but Fangs are not showing that to be true. I, I think Fangs just have a weaker goalie in Zamzi with only 38 catch, but it doesn't matter. I guess the Glory's loss is our gain as we get to take on the Ronzo Fangs. I'm really not that worried about that match, to be honest. I mean, maybe I should be scared, but like, eh, who cares? It's fine. We'll be, we'll be okay. All right. Well, either way, let's, uh, let's get Hot Springs back on people. My goodness, drop from quite a few players there. Here we are. Should be good. Just trying to get Mifuri that prize. Visual max pressure. Neff passed to pain. And Payne's gonna be pushing right side. Movie challenges, pain dodges, keeps on pushing forward. Attempts to set up Neff. Ah, oh, but the interception from Zondi is there. Neff challenges, Neff tackles, Neff steals. Beautiful. Johnson challenges, and Neff just cannot stay in there. Gaza passes to Newbie. Pass to Gosna. <laughs> a lot of developments here. Gosna passed to Newbie. Newbie passed to Gosna. Very back and forth of them. The 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 <laughs> the slow man's one two pass right there. All right. Well, July intercepts at least and says not today. I will say this. I feel like when July got the block increase, that made a huge change because there was a good portion of the series I feel where. July did not intercept things that should have been intercepted. But now, like, July's just, like, there and, you know, being like, hey, like, I will stop you. Good luck. Like, that's... It, it feels like it's made a difference. Gonna see Nubi pass to Gazna. See if uh, Yuma can make a difference here. Or July. Yeah. I thought they were immediately going to go for the shot, which is why I thought Yuma would be the one to intercept, but they just kept on swimming. I mean, that was... 
I mean, arguably that's something you can do, I guess. But, you know. Pain challenges. Pain steals. Beautiful. And Pain's pushing. Can't you get the goal? Oh. Volley. Beautiful. Like I said, Zamzi is not the strongest goalie in the world. F challenges and F steals. Beautiful. Challenges. Okay, here he passed the Neff. Nice. Neff's gonna pass the pain here. And Pain just cannot retain the ball as Nubi Ronso tackles, steals, and pushes forward. It's unlucky. Nubi passed to Gosna. Can they do it? Oh, Yuma with the big interception passes all the way to Payne. This just puts puts the ball just out of the stratosphere for these forwards on the Ronzo Fangs team. Set up for Neff? Oh, big interception from Erga. Prevents that potential 2-0 from placing. Kick and hold. Kyuri though intercepts. Oh, that is such an obvious interception. You saw Zondi like move in advance. I was gonna say if Kyuri intercepts that, like that's just comedy. Like that's just them passing back and forth. Gaza passing to seek. There's 45 whole seconds left, so a goal from the Ronto Fangs is not impossible. I feel like we need uh we need some pressure on on Basique. What are, you, what are you doing, Zev? You may intercepts, but this is where I get nervous, right? Because now we uh, we lose the ball. And uh, who stops Who stops uh, Gosna? Oh, I guess July does. July with the tackle with the injury on Gosna. That could be curtains. Like, the, the fact they have to get the ball back and attempt a goal is uh, there's no time. Like, look at the clock. We are three seconds left. And there it is. 1-0. Not a very impressive game, but a, a win nonetheless. And Mifuri can now have more range, which is really nice to test out our hypothesis here. And Glory's 1-0 the beast. I feel like they should even win by more, but you know, they won, so I, I can't really complain. I feel like the glory is definitely underperformed though, this uh, this tournament. But either way, let's send Lafurry away. And that is gonna be that. Uh, thank you all so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. And when you come back, gonna be playing more Blitzball. Till next time.